these communities have basically had their whole revenue infrastructure pulled out from under them. Uh, you know, the, the, you're going to see businesses that aren't going to be uh, ha collecting sales tax. You're not going to see tourists be able to visit for a while. That has major implication for mayors and governing bodies that have to decide where they get the financing to collect garbage and, you know, offer the other municipal services that they do for their residents. We're the owner of Lavalette uh, Pizza and Oven Pizza in Lavalette, and, um, you know, there's been a lot of problems for small business getting help from uh, FEMA, the SBA. You know, they've quoted the uh, COBRA, which is the uh, Coastal Barrier Resource Act, saying that they're uh, anybody on the island is ineligible to receive funds and our feeling is if they're going to rebuild the Jersey Shore it's all about the small business because nobody's going to come down here if they can't you know have something to eat or have an ice cream and most of the small business did not have uh, flood insurance. Uh, nobody's living in the Barrow Island at this point on this end of the Barrow Island at all. There's no electricity or gas service. Uh, there's still a major recovery and cleanup efforts going on. Uh, the tourism industry uh, provides $38 billion in revenue to the state uh, every year, and that's so, so important, not only for this area of the state, but for the entire state. I think we can not ignore the fact that we've had some really significant storms um, in a quick succession, and we need to make sure we're, we're planning smarter here and building like states that have frequent hurricanes built um, and looking at those codes and, and making sure we have sustainable buildings.